हेलो गाइज वेलकम बैक टू येट अनदर वीडियो फाइनल नथिंग आई स्टार्टेड रोलिंग आउट स्टेबल बिल्ड ऑफ नथिंग ओ एस टू डॉट फाइव बेस्ड ऑन एंड्रॉइड फोर्टीन फॉर नथिंग फोन वन इन दिस वीडियो विल टॉक अबाउट एवरी न्यू चेंज वॉट दिस अपडेट ब्रिंग्स ऑन द टेबल फॉर नथिंग फोन वन सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग एनी मोर टाइम लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड हेयर आई हैव माई नथिंग फोन वन विच आई ऑलरेडी अपडेटेड टू द लेटेस्ट बिल्ड ऑफ नथिंग ओ एस टू डॉट फाइव डॉट टू लेट मी शो यू दिस सॉफ्टवेयर इन्फॉर्मेशन हेयर यू कैन सी नथिंग ओ एस टू डॉट फाइव डॉट टू एंड्रॉइड वर्जन इज एंड्रॉइड फोर्टीन दिस कम्स विद फर्स्ट जैन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर स्टेज ऑल आउट सो सम यूजर्स माइट नॉट रिसीव इट राइट अवे विद इन अ डे और टू यू गाइज शुड रिसीव इट एंड आई ट्राई टू प्रोवाइड द फुल जिप फाइल ऑफ दिस अपडेट इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बिलो आई वॉज ऑलरेडी रनिंग बीटा वर्जन ऑन माई नथिंग फोन वन सो आई रिसीव एन ओ टी ए अपडेट एंड द अपडेट साइज ऑफ दिस बिल्ड वॉज सिक्सटी एट पॉइंट फोर एट एम बी ओवर बीटा टू यू गाइज माइट रिसीव एन लार्ज अपडेट इफ यू आर रनिंग एंड्रॉइड थर्टीन एंड नाउ बिफोर मूविंग अहेड इफ यू गाइज लाइक अ कॉन्टेंट एंड इफ यू थिंक इट्स यूजफुल फॉर यू गाइज दैन मेक शोर टू स्मैश दट लाइक बटन एंड ऑल्सो कंसिडर सब्सक्राइबिंग टू अ चैनल विल टॉक अबाउट एवरी न्यू चेंज वॉट नथिंग हैव बॉड ऑन द टेबल सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल हियर यू कैन सी दे हैव मैंशन ऑल द चेंजेस वॉट एंड्रॉइड फोर्टीन ब्रिंग्स फॉर नथिंग फोन वन which are related to customization glyph interface gestures quick settings new widgets and they have also done few improvements if you guys have been following us then you should remember on nothing phone 2 nothing did mention a change log for nothing os 2.5.2 which says added support for switching ring modes in the quick setting so this thing wasn't available on nothing phone 2 but this have been added on nothing phone 1 let me show you how you can access it so if you go to quick setting tiles you need to tap on this edit button there'll be a tile which will mention the current mode of your device for example vibrate silent or ring that tile you need to shift it towards the top side i mean the main quick setting tiles so here you can see this is that tile i'll show you on the main page of quick setting here you can see now it says vibrate because my device is in vibration mode you can just switch the ring modes by single tap and you can also add this quick setting tiles on the home screen widgets to easily switch between different ring modes hopefully that will be added on nothing phone 2 with the upcoming build now talking about the customizations nothing have done a lot of customizations on nothing phone 2 first change what you'll notice and that's here when you long press and go to customization section So here on single page you can have access to home screen and lock screen from where you can customize the widgets shortcuts make changes in the lock screen wallpapers and the home screen wallpapers it will save a lot of time if you are more into customization and they have also added a new wallpaper effect so for example this is the wallpaper if you tap here on the tick mark you can see there's a new option towards the bottom side which says atmosphere you can turn it on this is how it will look on the lock screen and if you unlock your device you'll have this blurry effect it also gives a description which says atmosphere requires using the same wallpaper to transition seamlessly between the lock screen and the home screen so let me show you how does it look i have applied that effect what i'll do is i'll lock the device and now i'll unlock and show you guys so soon you unlock you'll see that transition effect let me show you how does it look and there you go on beta builds the transition was not that smooth but now it is improved a lot also nothing have introduced a whole set of solid color wallpapers for a cleaner home screen appearance and you have total 20 solid color options available under the color section we have these two options wallpaper color and basic color for the basic color nothing have added this monochrome color option also and this is how it looks when i select the monochrome color now talking about other changes which are layered to glyph light so if you go to settings glyph interface now by default you can have access to music visualization previously we had to save a con tag to get access of this but now they have completely changed it and you can turn on music visualization just by going to glyph interface you'll also find a quick setting tiles in the quick settings options you just need to tap on that edit icon and here you can see we have a music visualization tab you can drag and move it towards the top side and now syncing of glyph light while playing music is too good compared to previous builds later they have improved overall glyph light playback effect when synchronizing with the device audio also a new animation have been added when nfc in used at last under glyph interface they have improved the experience of flip to glyph now talking about the other changes which are layered to gestures so if you go to settings system under gestures nothing have given more options. to customize the double press power button so where you can choose things like camera torch device control video camera do not disturb mute and also you can trigger specific applications if you want to then nothing have added more lock screen shortcut options for example 
Here you can see these are the options now present for the lock screen shortcuts. And all these options you can find it with the right button and the left button too. Now you also have the option to take a screenshot using three finger screenshot gesture. We also have advanced editing options under the screenshot. So if you take a screenshot, soon you tap on it towards the bottom side, you can see there are few color options available. You have the mosaic option to blur out the sensitive information and other marking tools can be found here. Also now if you see the back gesture arrow, which got this nothing theme and now this arrow have this dotted format also another change when it comes to quick setting tiles now you can make changes in the network settings without unlocking the device so if your device is locked you can make changes or modifications in the network settings without even unlocking it after that we have a updated quick setting tiles and it also brings support to show more device icons after that with nothing os 2.5 nothing also brings few new widgets let me show you those widgets if you go to widget section so here you can see first one is this media player second one is this pedometer and the third one is screen time and they are very useful widgets let me show you how does it work so once you apply these widgets on the home screen you can slide up to get more info like how much you have walked today and you can also set the goal so for example if i go to settings under pedometer you can set a daily goal by default it is set to 8000 you can make changes and customize as per your requirement and you'll also see this preview moving depending on the steps you have taken and the target you have set to know exact count you can just slide the widget which will show you your step count on daily base and seven days average also and the next widget is this music widget so how does it work it won't work until unless you are playing any music in the background so for example i've started playing one music and now you'll be able to see the details in this music tile on the main home page you'll get to see the thumbnail of that particular song sliding towards the bottom side you have this progress bar along with the other details of the song and the app icon and the last widget is this screen on time for example you can set the daily limit for how long you want to use your device depending on that you can see the progress bar here if you slide up right now you can see i just started using this device and it shows me eight minutes of screen on time under more improvements they have optimized the experience of weather application and improved the notifications of weather alert that we'll get to know once we start using the device overall i personally like the weather application which comes on nothing phone or nothing os 2.5 and another change what they have done now it is possible to set ringtones and notification sound volume separately with an updated volume control interface so if you go to settings sounds now you can see we have two sliders one to set ring volume and one to set notification volume that can also be seen if you press the volume buttons and tapping on this arrow here you can see the different sliders for the ringtones and notifications and another nice change what i notice is like whenever we take a screenshot previously on other devices what i have seen i'm not sure about nothing phone one so if i take a screenshot and quickly again i have to take a screenshot the preview used to appear in that second screenshot but now nothing says automatically excludes the preview of the previous screenshot when taking continuous screenshots so if you are taking continuous screenshots the preview will be automatically excluded from that as you can see here soon i take a screenshot the previous preview goes away after that they say they have improved the stability of the camera that i'll get to know once i start using the device and in the review video i'll let you know how much camera have been improved then they have enhanced the overall smoothness and responsiveness of the system for a more fluid user experience and that true now you can clearly feel that smoothness while scrolling on your device and at last they have enhanced the system stability and improved battery battery life about the battery life also we'll get to know after two three cycles so i'll keep you guys posted in the review video so guys these were all the changes what nothing os 2.5.2 brings on the table for nothing phone one with this stable release if you guys have any kind of questions let me know in the comment section below this is your friend ashok signing out see you guys in the next video